Today also, folks, the skies have been so blue and so blue. I think it's gonna rain. Hey, good afternoon, good evening, Dawn with two hip chicks. How are you? How's it going? Pretty good. Oh, How's it cool. doing? I'm hanging on. I'm hanging on. I'm hanging, hanging on. in there and hanging on. Yeah, yeah, hanging on. Uh, oh, new background. I got uh, the leaves. Hmm? I got the leaves. Yeah, that's different. Is that is that new? Uh, I was I was doing a private hangout this afternoon and I just turned off the background. Hmm, good. So. Works good. I may have to adjust my camera a little bit. It's, I just realized I'm I have no top to my head. This is the default. That's a little better. So, uh, That's a little better. I have some top to my head now. Oh, I'll cool. leave you. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. So um, thank you everyone for joining tonight. We're doing a. Oh, there a you go. Record sell, and um, and Dawn has some CDs. Hey, um, ATC, how are you? I, I actually have video and audio this time. Yay! Yeah, I tell yeah. you, things happen so strange on the iPhone. What the heck was that? What the problem was? iPhone? Sure. Well, for me, it is. Sometimes I'm online, and then all of a sudden, I can't hear a thing. Yeah. That is weird. Yeah. Hey, hey, Triple home. Craig, how are you, sir? Thanks for joining. Um, Adam, how are you, sir? Thank you. Thank you for joining, Adam. I appreciate that. And then there's Jerry Fuller. Hey, Jerry, how are you? Miss you too, my man. Have to stop by and say hi sometimes. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Good, thank you, howdy. Hey, hey there's Amber. Hey, Amber. Yeah, wow. So cool, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, so, um, that's my space. Yes, I've been I've been inspecting this morning some of the records I got in on Saturday, so I'll have those to offer. And Bone's going to have some CDs. CDs yeah. today. Is that your disc washer? Oh yeah, that's an antique <laughs> disc washer. Do you have all the inserts? I have. Well, what I have is just this with that this guy. I got mm -hmm. the, the brushy thing. The brush. And it's been gone over, uh, probably stained up from alcohol, but it still is not ripped and it's it cleans up nicely. So I, I have I have two of these actually. I have one down here and one upstairs. Wow. And I wouldn't trade them for the world. Very good. I had a buyback one time, Dawn, and so I got the one that's like this big. Oh yeah. With the dome cover. So it has the zero stat zapper. Yep. And it has that plus that, that and then it, it's got the nice, um, I think it's, is it walnut? Anyway, the wood. Oh, yeah. Wood. It's beautiful wood if it hadn't been all trashed by whoever owned it previously. But when I see these at garage sales, I suck them up quickly because they're great. Absolutely. If you ever see one out there, grab it. They're just such a nice, they're such a nice cleaner. Oh, I do. I grab them as much as I can. And I like it when they come in for buybacks. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Star Man, how are you? Long time to see. Glad you're on. Uh, yeah. I put myself on. Yeah, that sounds wonderful. Yeah. So, There's yeah. the comments. Adam's got his serious avatar. It's Absolutely. It's very serious. Yeah. It's very Let's serious. see. Uh, T asks, TC, does anybody have the old record and CD openers? No. I wish I did. No, uh, that's cool. Do you know what they are, Don? Uh, it, it's, it just it opens the, um, the cellophane, right? It was almost like a little triangle thing, but it had a recessed area with a razor blade. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I, I, I've been wanting one for a while. Hey, Tom, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Uh, Don, we've got some people here, so I think I'm going to get started. I want to thank everybody for stopping by. I'm going to tell you how I'm going to do it, then Don will tell you how she's going to do it. So if anything you're interested in, just comment in the chat, the item, and the price. Uh, email me within 24 hours, and you can look at the email right there. It's like a little train. I'm rolling. And, uh, shipping is $5. Excuse me. Shipping is $4. Insurance is 75 cents for up to, I think I can do five records in a box now. The I'm out of the boxes that held 10, uh -huh. so I'm at five. And so um, that's what we've got going on, folks. So um, I'll get started, and then Dawn, uh, I'll do a few, then Dawn will come in and do a few, and we'll just make it happen. Sounds good. Uh, yeah. Hey, if you ever find any, let me know. Uh, if, you, if there's a name of them that, even if you find an image, TC, 
if there's a name and I can try my best to. Uh... All right, I just sold something. I'm happy. Happy days. Uh, yeah, happy yeah, day. yeah. Uh, but yeah, I'll try to see if I can track some down. Hey, uh, Jennifer, yeah, how are you? thanks for stopping by. Um, well, thankfully, yes, Craig. Um, Jennifer's really... the best. Isn't she though? Yeah. I swear she needs a Venmo account. I would send her a quarter or 50 cents every time she promotes yep. me. Hey, Glenn, top use live chat, not, non, not top chat. That's exactly Thank right. You, Glenn. Glenn. Yeah. I know, I know, I know. Uh, yeah, Thank so. You. Oh, here's Pick with Joy. Hey, Joy, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Good to see you. Yeah. All right. Dom? You go first. I'm hanging. Okay. There we go. There we go. Sorry about that. Um, so this is uh, Joe Cocker. I can stand a little rain. This is five dollars. Um, I got a nice copy of Saturday Night Fever. I haven't had a nice copy like this in a while. This one's ten dollars, folks. It's a night fever, night fever. Uh, Kinks presents. Uh, Schoolboys in Disguise, and I cannot for the life of me remember the label. So hold just a second. Let's take a look at it. If you want me to show the label or anything, folks, please let me know. This is RCA. It needs a bath, but it looks nice. Uh, RCA, yeah. So this one is $10, folks, for the kinks. And, you know, they got their uh, they got their self ready for um, for their family portrait. I love it. Yeah. Um, the best of Sam and Dave, $8. I got to play this. If it sells, I'm going to play it. Uh, and um, yeah. Uh, here's a nice copy of Duran Duran Rio. This is $8. And uh, Tina. We go. Tina Turner. Uh, yeah, Private Dancer. It has a David Bowie song on here. And so there you go. But this one's a nice copy. Tina Turner is $10. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, a Flock of Seagulls. This one's a nice copy also uh, somewhere on the spine. But this one is $10, folks. A Flock of Seagulls. And uh, there we go. Nice. Nice, nice, baby. Um and so there we go. Um, uh, Starman says RCA. Yep, RCA. And it's always nice, a nice baby. It's okay. A for the king. So I had a, um, I went to an estate sale and they had a lot of CDs and they were in pretty good shape. So I thought I'd share them with you guys. And what I'm going to do is $3, no matter what title, plus shipping. So, and, you know, shipping it'd be probably depending on the, the weight, but mostly first class is like three, maybe four dollars. So I mean, how many you get. So let me put, hold on. This is the email that you can send to uh, if you're interested. Uh, also, just put it in the chat, but that's where I'll need your information. So if you do pick up something, send me an email with your contact info. OK, here we go. Uh, we're getting rid of that one. So we've got. Shania Twain, come on over. We've got classic Sinatra, Frankie Boy. Um, you familiar with this one, Adam? No, no, what label is that? That is under the. It says Narada. Wait a minute. Yeah, Narada label. Oh wow. The band. I'm not. I am not familiar with that, but it looks, oh, this is the back, and it looks like it is orchestral. Okay. Is it, have, is it one in a, a violin on the cover? That is a violin. It looks more electric than it does. Uh, does it? Yeah, yeah. I don't hmm. know. Uh, L-E-A-C-H-Y. Yeah, 1996. Okay. Okay. I've got a Rod Stewart human without the booklet, but it does. It is in the appropriate case. So if you like Rod Stewart, there's your shot. Al Martino, greatest 
Gentleman of Song. Now, this is one that not everybody got a hold of. Uh, if you like Reba McIntyre, she was linked in with Whirlpool for a while. You know, they make the washers. Oh, yeah. And this was a release that she had. Um, it's three songs, but maybe somebody collects CDs or, or you know, limited run prints. This would be good. It is. Uh, it was sponsored by Habitat for Humanity. Uh, and then there's um, a couple of uh, a couple of songs on here. But that's the Reba McIntyre Whirlpool release. So there's that. I've got John Denver, Annie song. Mm. Yeah, I know. I love John Denver. And then I've got Africana volume one. And it's rhythms from the motherland. I'm going to take a peek at what is on it. I'll try to do less glare. There we go. And there you go. That is my first lot of CD or D yeah, CDs. Okay. If interested in any of those? Let me know. There may be a um, Chieftain's connection with that uh, Leachy uh, CD. Really? Yeah. Um, this one? Yeah, yeah. He's looking. It may be, it may be Irish folk. I didn't Produced know. by Lance Anderson. Oh, yeah, Lance. Oh, yeah, Lance. You remember Lance? Yeah, he shared a studio with me one day. There you go. Thanks to mom and dad, yeah. <laughs> the family. Yeah. Well, Honorable cool. mention to so and so, but yep, it might be. Yeah, and if you're watching the replay, if you're watching the repeat, folks, just um, reach out to us if you see anything yeah. you're interested in. Yeah. I will honor that price. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's see Howdy. if we can make it happen. Uh, Fifteen people here. Thank you guys so much for coming out tonight. I appreciate it a bunch. This is Cindy Lauper. It's got the shrink and it's got the uh, hype sticker. Nice. And uh, yeah, uh, Cindy is eight dollars. Okay. This is Aretha's greatest hits, and I uh -huh. think this is an original pressing. Uh, it's got the staple in the corner, or one time the. The price sticker was put on there. This oh, one's yeah. ten dollars for Aretha. I've had I've had them with the staples many times, but I also had them with the staple that had um the price sticker still attached. Yeah. Uh, this is Toto Four. This is the yeah. one that has Rosanna. Yep, good album. Yeah, this one is twelve dollars. Uh, this is Daryl Hall and John Oaks, eight dollars. I love this record. Um. This is Jethro Tull, Aqualong. Oh, beautiful. This one is $8, and it does have the lyric sheet on the inside. Nice. Yeah. Uh, Elton John is Breaking Hearts. Elton he John is... Um, certainly is. Is $6, and it does have shrink. Yeah, Elton John. Nice. Yeah. Well, cool. Well, there we go. That's um, quick. Okay. Same, same deal. $3 plus ship. Celine Dion, and you know, these are titles you might already have or want to pick up on CD so you can listen to them elsewhere. Another Celine, which one's this one? Oh, these are special times. <laughs> these are special times. Sorry. Here's um, 1959 Rhythm and Blues. Ooh. That's on the Time Life Warner label. Martina McBride's Greatest Hits. She's very patriotic there. She's very patriotic. She's red on the back. Um, this one is German. I have no idea. Dokken, dokken. There you go. It is German all, all the way through it. So if you just want to pick up something to see if you like it, this this here's your shot. Three bucks. ECHT is that the band? ECHT. I have no idea. Natalie Cole, Love Songs. Uh, Joni Messia, Burn. And last but not least in this pile is No Doubt, uh, which is their Rock Study album. So it's a double CD. And they're both in there. So, doing it. so that's a double CD. And that's what I have for that pile. Very cool. Uh, Kurt is saying that uh, Celtic. Celtic, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Good I evening, Mary Lane. Thanks for stopping by tonight. We appreciate it. 
yeah appreciate everybody being here um i think i do tom i'll i'll, I'll when i dig and i find it i'll i'll reach back to you do you have cassettes Don? he's looking mccartney on cassette i have cassettes i will have to go through if i find any i'll let you know for sure okay german pop I bet is that what that is? yeah okay well if i don't sell it i'll play it i'm gonna listen to it then there you go that yeah. is cool i mean it's a cool Good to know. Thank what you. What year is it? I mean, it's kind of interesting. What, what would we do without these guys? Let's see. Sometimes things. Are... Party like it's 1999, people. 99? Yeah. Kurt. Sometimes we have music that's popular in America that's not popular in other places and yeah. vice versa. But sometimes it's worldwide, but it's always neat to hear other popular music in other countries. Yeah. Well, cool. Uh, thanks for sharing that, uh, Kurt. All right, here we go, folks. Uh, these are all three dollars, three dollars each. Um, so they're better than my dollar records. Nineteen ninety-nine. <laughs> hey, Gina, how are you? It's good to see you. Good to see Gina and her cat that's destined to be a star. Oh, I um, love that cat. And so these might have a mark on them, or they might have a dish, uh, but I. I could take the time to play them with my weight and clap, but here we go, folks. $3 each if you're interested. Uh, there we go. Howard Jones. I love this record, and I was so glad that it was. Uh, uh, um, this is Bob Seeger and the Silver Bullet Band. This is um, Still Again, Stilly Dan. Cacho. You did make your cat in space. I like it. That's totally cool. I'm hanging on there. Thank you so much for asking. I hope you are too. Ding, 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 ding. Uh, who's this? This is uh, Santana. Oh. Uh, the Righteous Brothers. And I think this is an original press, and usually there's something at the top that says digital. But, uh, yeah, that, that looks like it. Yeah. This is No Diamond. You don't bring me flowers anymore. Uh, this is the beautiful Gloria Estefan. This has a gold stamp promo in the back, folks. Who might this be? Oh, the best of BTO. I think they're Canadian. Hey. Taking care of business. They look like they're having a blast. Looks like Bluegrass Picker wants to say Santana 3. Okay. Thank you, Bluegrass Pico Picker. I'll put that on the printer in just a moment. Uh, this is Dean Martin. Oh, you're right. That is Dean Martin. <laughs> Another Canadian, eh? Brian Adams. And uh, it's the summer of 69. Uh, this is Spotlight on Ray Charles. Ah. This feels very heavy. Is that like a very thick pressing? It is. Wow. Yeah. So on the design label, I always thought this would make a great clock right here. You have. Uh, oh, that is cool. Yeah. You have uh, Ray Charles, Dorsey Brothers, Sammy Davis Jr., Eddie Con. I've never heard of Sammy Davis Sr. Um, well, you know. Fabulous Sing Spots, uh, Lumont, Della Reese, Gloria Lynn. Nice. Some nice, nice names on there. And this is Asia. 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 With the beautiful cover. So there we go. Asia That's has a little group right there. Um, and I'm gonna I'm Pick. going to uh, don't forget to put uh that one on the printer. Yeah. There you go. I got one. Second, I'm gonna show Anthony that I'm putting on the printer. Just show put, Anthony that you put it on the printer so Anthony does not. Okay. Here you go, Anthony. It's on the printer. There you go. It looks like you raided my music collection. I totally. did. I did. I did. I'm so all glad. those that you have, they're like 80s. And oh my goodness. Yeah. Okay. I have an, a sealed CD here. It's the Untrained Layman mm -hmm. Eye of the World. I'm not sure what they do. Jazz. I believe is, this is a jazz album from 2012. What label is it? The label is. Uh, Hugh Jazz Records. Oh, 
Just like Hugh Jackman, only Hugh Jazz. Um, Little Big Town. Oh, yeah, Little Big Town. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry about the glare. The Road to Here. For those who just came in, we're doing these for $3 a piece plus shipping. Tony Bennett, all time greatest hits. And according to the sticker, 20 classic tracks, first time on CD. We'll see about that. Yeah. Okay, this is Romantica by Bob Culberson. And this is obviously, uh, let me show you the back of the album, okay? Does that seem right to you? Is that a crayon? No, that's a. No, that's, yeah. a, that's his instrument. Yeah, we'll that's just call a, that. yeah. Same as the instrument on the front, only he seems to be enjoying it. So there's that one. Um, this is, I'm not sure who this is. This is from 2012, Stony Beach Music. It's called Vietnam There and Back. Mm -hmm. And all songs are written by Jim Pertel, L. Turlslow, and Ricky E. Bellos. I have no idea. It looks like a bunch of songs about Vietnam. I have not listened to it, but it's in really good shape, so I didn't feel the need. Johnny Mathis. Oop, almost got it there. This is our time. I've got a Celine Dion. I'm still getting a lot of glare off of that. There we go. And a Frank Sinatra romance. There's a lot of, yes, romantic stuff. And last, we've got Wine Country Collection. It's a you know, just an assortment of songs, wine and roses. Oh. You know, for the mood setting. The set more the wine you drink, the better it sounds. Set the mood. There you exactly. go. The winier you get. There you go. Well, thank you much. Hey, Tim, how are you doing? Thanks for stopping by tonight. We appreciate it greatly. Uh, yeah. Court was saying that's a Chapman stick. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's 10 strings and... It was it just the, the, the pose he did was kind of odd to me. Yeah. Well, he's just showing oh. his Chapman stick. Yeah, there you go. There you go. All right, uh, let's get back into the things right here with some vinyl, folks. Um, nope. Try again. There you go. Uh, Suzanne Vega. This one's $4. Sorry. Uh, Santana, Elton John, greatest hits. Oh, that's a good album. 10,000 Maniacs in My Tribe. <laughs> I just thought of something. <laughs> right. You get a little cheese with your wine. There you go. Yeah, a little cheese with my wine. Yeah. Hey, Stephen, how are you? Stephen Batten. Yes, Adam, I bring the unusual. Uh, some interesting titles. I bring there the you go. Bring it on. Bring it on home. Okay, great. And then I'm going to reach over here and grab some. Uh, Bluegrass Pickers said, was there another Santana? I just showed another Santana. It's $4. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Um, hey, Bruce, how are you? Good to see you. It is. It is, Bruce. Yeah, I am. Um, I thought somebody um, had requested it, so I had to send an email. <laughs> this is what's going on with your avatar, and uh, and and they said that wasn't the one, so I put it back. Okay, so Bruce, uh, yeah, so yeah, there you go, Bruce. Uh, Santana for four. Okay, I'm gonna grab this and put it on the printer. Where did it go? Things can happen so fast. True. Things can get out of your hands so fast. Oh, Welcome here. to my life. It's one of the sad. Yeah. Okay, Anthony, I'm putting this on the printer. Yeah. Thank you, Bruce, for stopping by. Yeah. Uh, all right. So um, this is a nice copy of Asia. 
And this is RE3, folks, RE3. Oh, yeah. And this one's got the proper answer. So this one is $15, folks, Asia. Oh. Uh, Pat Benatar, Crimes of Passion. Nice. You better run. This you one is better. $6. Uh, this is Chuck Berry Golden Hits. It's on the Mercury label. They're on the same label as Rush. Uh, this one is $8. She's having a baby. She is. Yeah. Soundtrack. And this one is um, Ghost Stamp. Ghost Stamp. Mm -hmm. And uh, anyway, this one is $6. Who's on here? Good thing. I'm glad you asked. Um, <laughs> Love and Rockets. David Wakeling. Gene loves Jezebel. I love Gene. XTC. Brian Ferry. You know, anything that Brian Ferry touches is gold. Uh, Christy, McCall, Everything But the Girl, mm. Bush, Carmel, and Dr. Kalakas. I don't know him. Anyway, uh, so you go. She was having a baby. Or is it? Yeah. And then um, the soundtrack for Platoon. Oh. Yeah, Aretha Franklin's on here, Otis Redding, Percy Sledge, The Rascals. It's a good soundtrack. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, Jefferson Airplane, The Doors, Merle Haggard, Smokey Robinson, and then, of course, there's some songs that uh, the Vancouver Symphony Orchestra. Mm -hmm. So there you go. Yeah, there's that guy from, uh, what was that cool movie? Um Oh gosh, they had that Malibu and it went up into the space and and all the, all the food at the grocery store was generic. It said beer. Uh, oh gosh, what was that movie? Oh gosh. Anyway, it's a punk rock coming of age movie. That's what it is. Okay. Repo Man, I think maybe. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Repo Man. Yeah. So there you go. All right. I don't know. Okay. Got some jazz, Nightfall, sophisticated jazz classics. What's that? Uh, more untrained layman. Now this one. So this is the cover on that one, and mm -hmm. it looks like there's some signatures on this. Oh wow! I don't really collect autographs, so yeah. So anyway. Uh, John Mayer. Uh, I have no idea. Uh, let's see. Easy Ed Wright and Jay Rusco, born to be a star. Oh, yes, they were born. Born to be a star. Born, born to be a star. <laughs> now, the thing is, this one also is signed <gasps> to June. June. Born to be a star. Oh, isn't that sweet? So I guess these belong to June. There you go. All right, we got Jack Johnson, "Sleep Through the Static." Oh yeah, that's good stuff. Yeah. Is that one? Here's one that actually I listened to on vinyl just the other night to to grade it. Uh, Johnny Cash at San Quentin. Dun, dun, dun. It's a it's a good album. Yeah. So anyway. Does that one have any bonus tracks? Dun, 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 dun. Yes. Is that one factory seal? No. It's it got paper, paper, some, it has yeah. paper in it. Cool. It has a bonus track. It has um previously unreleased bonus track is I Walk the Line of Ring of Fire and the Rebel and Johnny Yuma. If you're so inclined, there it is. Yeah, on the Legacy label. I like Legacy. They did some good stuff. They did. Yeah. That's Natalie Cole. Ooh. Still unforgettable. I have another one with no uh, booklet, but the disc is in the proper case. B.J. Thomas' Greatest Hits. And last but not least, I believe this is also German. Film Hits. Uh, Long Road to Justice, Streets of Philadelphia, um, Raymond Charles. 
Singing in the Rain, Frankie Vaughn. It's just got a bunch of miscellaneous um, music from film. It's probably German pressing because it's all in German on the inside. Go ahead. I'll wait, wait while you read it. <laughs> you can talk and rock and roll it. Yeah, you can rock and rock and roll it. There you go. That's what I've got. Oh, very cool. Let's see. Uh, uh, Kurt said uh, Repo Man. Thanks, Kurt. Repo Man. Uh, Hit the hit the hit the thumbs up. Don't be a bum. Hit the thumb. Um, this is for you, Dawn. Oh yeah, let me find it. <laughs> it's in here somewhere. I'll write it down. You're not gonna put it on the printer. I I could. My printer's right here. <laughs> oh. Let me let me let me get it. Thank you. My mom is going outside. She likes to tell me these things. That's good. Ugh. All right. I'll pull those while do you have any more to do? Yeah, I do. Uh, just catching uh -huh. up with some comments. Tim says hi. Hi, Tim. How you doing, and, Tim? Well, the scene was in uh, Reaper Man. Yeah. I enjoyed that movie. Me too. I I remember uh, Myra says, I, Myra Lane says, I remember the scene from Reaper Man where they. Or saying that driving makes you stupid. <laughs> yeah. Ain't it true? All right. There's no. this one. Printer. And then what was the other one? Ooh, uh, I was what was which one was that? That was the that was this one. Okay. E E Eek E C H T oh, e e e Yeah, the German one. Yeah. What is Eek? Did I miss it? Hmm. And it's got to be in this other one. Oh, 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 oh. There she blows on the printer. All right. Thank you. So Thank you. Uh, Myra would like to know, Myra Lane would like to know if that Johnny Cash has personal Jesus on it. On that one? Yeah, the Johnny Cash. Hmm, just a second. Because now it got buried. Where did I put Johnny? Johnny. Johnny. That's the fun part. Finding Johnny Cash. Oh, there he is. Okay. First of all, Jesus, I... You know what? No. No personal Jesus. No personal Jesus on this. Okay, gotcha. Uh, Starman saying those legacy remasters from the early 2000s are really nicely done. Great for any enthusiasts of balanced, smooth mastering, especially the reissues, uh, the reissued Greatest Hits one. Yeah. I totally agree with you there, Star. They are nice. Hello, KK. Thanks for stopping by tonight. Good to see you. Uh, yes, it's, it's kind of, it's not really show and tell, it's show and sell. Show and show. Show and show. Say that five times fast. I don't think you can. Show and sell. It's just a game we play. Good what do you want to say? Uh, oh, yeah, they're all doing well. They're just doing other stuff. Thank you for asking. But we'll marry be on tomorrow. And Tom and Kurt says, no, it doesn't. There we go. So. It doesn't. Okay, I'm going to go big, and I'm going to show some more records. Go big. or Yeah, go big. All right. Um, well, I'm going to share this with folks. Um, so this is a CD. Uh, this is a vinyl compilation called Grow. Uh, it's from my buddies um, who own this label, Fort Lowell Records. But this is 100%. This is for... Um, it's music for a cause, so 100% of the sales from this record will be donated to the new Hanover County NAACP to help ensure the political, educational, social, and economic equality of rights of all persons and to eliminate race-based discrimination. So this is Hanover County. New Hanover County is in Wilmington, North Carolina, or Wilmington's in New Hanover. And uh, so um, Tracy Shad is on here, and uh, as well as some other cool bands from not only North Carolina, but from Arizona and some other places. But uh, Love Language is on here, as well as Rosebuds, which are, you know, based in our area. Anyway, so if you like to support, every record is a different color. So there you go. So if you like to support that, let me know, and I can uh, help you facilitate that. Um, let's see where we are. Um
this is a um oh yeah oh i found more that i had i totally forgot uh what is james's last name jesus no james james who that's what she wants to know. James Brown. Uh, James, James. Did we talk about a James? All right. I'm 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 lost there. Uh, I'm not sure which James we're talking about. You're welcome. Oh, thank you so much, Kurt. It was a response to your video. Uh, Kurt had a video. Uh, Kurt, you're welcome to put a link to your channel, but Kurt's been doing uh, turkeys. He's been doing turkeys all month. Yeah. Yeah, so here we go. Folks, this is a nice copy of NXS Kick. This one's $15. Oh, great album. Yeah, it is. You just don't see them anymore. This is Heart is $6. Oh. James Taylor. Oh, yeah. Oh, James. Um, so James Trenton. Uh, Triton. Triton. T-R-I-T-T-O-N. Triton. Uh, so he, he was originally from Jacksonville and... and um, yeah, there you go. How much for this shirt? Uh, this one's <laughs> probably too big for you, KK, but I have some other ones that are... Kathy loves her tie-dye, man. Don't, oh, don't touch it. That's cool. But uh, my buddy up in Charlotte does these tie-dyes. And um, and if you like, uh, if you like Kathy, I can reach back with you and uh, and help you out there. His father still lives in Jacksonville, Myra. Uh, and... He was associated with that music scene. I forgot the name of the club and everything, but uh, there we go. Yeah, yeah. Hey, there's Yolanda. And a 15. And a okay. 15. But um, yeah, so there you go. <laughs> Thank you, Yolanda. I'll put this on the uh I'll put this on the printer. Oh, Yolanda. In if I ever gonna get your stuff shipped, every time I'm ready to ship something, Yolanda says. Oh, I want this one. Oh, yeah. Throw one more in. There you go. That's totally cool. You're like, I'm a big woman. <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> the only sizes I have, and I'm, I'm not putting you on the spot at all, KK, the largest that I currently have is a 2X. I have XL. I have large. I have mediums. And I think they're all just kind of like the, they're not the girly cut, if that makes any sense. Oh, wonderful. Oh, great. I would love to get Yolanda on customer service one day. That would be wonderful. Um, okay, cool. Um, oops. Yeah, TC, I'm going to reach out to JC and see if we can make something happen. Oh, yeah, Arthur. Um, I'm sorry. I thought that was TC. TC loves tie-dye, too. Okay, cool, uh, Art. We'll make it happen for you. I'll corral some together. Well, dang. Kathy wants a 2X. Yeah, yeah. Uh, hi, y'all. Kathy would like a 2X? Okay. She said. Kathy, uh, email me, KK, and um, I think I left most my tie dyes up in Wake Forest, but we'll make it happen, folks. Absolutely. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to take my fast car and I'm going to go to Wake Forest and look for those t shirts. This is Chapman. Oh, gosh. Is this not just a wonderful album? Oh it's man, hard to find these folks anymore. And this one's also fifteen dollars for the Tracy Chapman um, original motion picture soundtrack, the Flamingo Kid, the Flamingo Kid. That has some excellent mm -hmm. music on it too. Yeah, I love this. I love this. Love it. This one's six dollars. It does have some good music. Absolutely, Martha Reeves and the Vandellas, mm -hmm. uh, the Cliftons, um, Dion, Little Richard. Oh my. Uh, Impressions, Hank Mallard in the Midnighters, The Silhouettes, Maureen Still. Mm -hmm. Good stuff, folks. There we go. I want to see that movie again. I haven't seen it in a while. Uh, Janet, okay, 3X for, uh, yeah. Um, so this is uh, Janet Jackson with Control. I think it's Control. I can't remember. Yeah, it is Control. Yeah. Yeah, she's eight dollars. Uh, Cheap Trick at Budokan. Mm -hmm. Six dollars. I love this record, folks. You broke my heart. Uh, no jackets required for this one. Ah, close this down. Is, uh, 
It's got my favorite Phil Collins song on it. Um, Which is? Inside Out. I love this song, Inside Out. Hadn't heard it forever, and I was eating a, a burrito at uh, Cosmic Cantina one day. Sounds like a story out of Repo Man. What? Yeah. <laughs> and they played, they played Inside Out. And I was it's like, time to hear the song Inside Out as you're eating a burrito. There you go. And they played this song, and I was like, wait a minute. I haven't heard that song in forever. What is it? And then I said, oh, Shazam. And it was Phil Collins with Inside Out. Anyway, my favorite Phil Collins song. Oh, see you later, Tim. Have a good night. Oh, bye, Tim. Yeah, maybe I'll see you tomorrow on Coffee and Vinyl. Uh, this is Chicago 17. This one is $8. Nice. Uh, this is Whitney Wood, the shrink and the hype sticker. Mm. And Whitney is uh, $10. Saving all my love for you. Is that on there? Yeah. Uh, Alice Cooper, welcome to my nightmare. This one is $6. I really like this record. I like Alice Cooper Band. I like it when it was a band, but I really like that record. Uh, this is Peter Gabriel without any text. So that's so without the text. Yeah. Yeah. So it's $10. Nice. nice. I, think, I think that no text came first. And this is uh, Sticks. Um, Pieces of Eight. Yeah. yeah. And this is a hypnosis cover. That's scary that I recognized it from you flipping through it without even being on camera. Isn't that awesome? I love this record. It's a good album. Yeah, yeah I like the, the way they did that album cover. Um, I'm going to have to do next week or something, TC, uh, to make up for my week. Uh, Kurt will like So, so I'm going to take So and put it on my printer. Yeah, good album. Good choice. Good yeah. choice for Kurt. Let's see. There you go. It's on the printer, sir. Ever since I had that, over, I'm sorry. I was going to say, ever since I had that faux pas with buying more than one copy of Christopher Cross, I'm not allowed to buy multiple albums anymore. The wife will not let me. Even if it's got no text? I know. Yeah, we have it, so it's okay. I'm good with that. Oh, thank I, you. I'm peace with it already. Yeah. I'm good. Thank you uh, for that email so quick, Kathy. KK, I appreciate that. Yeah. She's on it. She's on it, yeah. She is well, on cool. No, that so is a good album, though. I love it. Absolutely. Okay, here we go. Okay. I'm putting an email in the chat. So, um, TKR, you got that. If you can just send me your contact info for those other ones, I'll, we'll go there. Speaking of classic albums, not really. Uh, this one is Regis and Joy. <laughs> oh. Now, is Joy his wife? Yes. They, yes. They are, this is on Red Dot Records from, when is this? Gosh, when is this? I don't know. It's got to be the early 2000s, I would think. Is so that one? No. He was a hoot. I missed him. <laughs> yeah. I've got Celine Dion taking chances. That outfit is definitely taking chances. Woohoo! Renee said, woohoo! Yeah, there you go. TKR wants Regis. <laughs> <laughs> you got it, huh? I'll throw it on, throw it on the thing. Um, let's see, Gretchen Wilson, and I believe yeah. that's country. She's country, yeah. She's country. Yeah. Oh, I already put it on the printer for you. We have the essential Barbara Streisand. Her, yeah, I know. <laughs> Uh, you want Celine taking chances too? Okay. Also on the printer. Moving on up. Uh, Cecilia? Am I pronouncing that right? Amazing Grace. Yes, yes, Cecilia. Okay. 2007. She, she broke my heart. She broke your heart. Cecilia. She You're broke breaking my heart. My heart. I get it now. Okay, I got you. We've got uh, Shaggy. Hot shot. We've got some secrets with Tony Braxton. Actually, I like Tony Braxton's voice. Yeah, she does have a good voice. She has a good voice. Uh, ooh, help me with, I, I'm probably massacring this name. Emil LaRue. Ooh. Yeah, that looks good to me. Okay. 
Um, I always massacre this guy's name, Michael Bublé. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this oh. is sealed. Oh, it this is. is sealed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, I Michael Bublé. I wish Bemos was here. She can say that her. Um, she has a relative that plays with him. Oh, really? That's cool. Um, let's see. James Asher, Feet in the Soil. James Asher. Huh. It's it's very uh, tribal. Oh. I guess you call it. Last but not least in this stack is Billy Joel's Greatest Hits, Volume 3. Mm. So it's got Keeping the Faith, Innocent Man, Matter of Trust, all the ones you remember. We Didn't Start the Fire. So there's those. Wonderful. Yeah. So yeah. I pulled those two. I've got Celine and Regis for uh, TKR, right? There you go. Got it. Marilyn says, don't be a bomb. Hit the thumb. Don't hit the thumb. Yeah. Come on. There we go, folks. All right. All right here goes some records. Uh, this is the oh. Jay Giles Band. And this is uh, Ladies Invited. $6. I am not familiar with that album. I guess I'm not really into Jay Giles, but that yeah. looks it's interesting. Oh, Myra Elaine would like to know if Allentown is on that uh, CD of Billy Joel. Blah, 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 blah. Man, matter trust. I do not see Allentown on this one. I do not see it. There you go. All right, here's that cool jazz cat, uh, Kazumi. This one is ten dollars. Um. Okay, TKR. I'll pull the James Asher for you too. Ooh, very cool. Thank you. Uh, this is John Fahey. Popular songs of Christmas and New Year's. Guitar instrumentals. Okay. This one is $10. This is the Four Seasons. Ooh. <laughs> Trying to read it. Sec second <laughs> vault of Golden Hits. I'm, I'm getting closer. It's hard to read to the it. camera, isn't it? Yeah, it is. But, um. Six dollars for the four seasons. Uh, this is traffic. I love traffic. Um, I don't care so much for best of or greatest hits myself, but uh, this is a good listen. I like to listen to the entire album. So, anyway, this is traffic, folks. It's eight dollars. It's on the United Artists label. It's a nice introduction, though, if you haven't, if you're not familiar with traffic, it's not a bad album. Yeah. I mean, they do, they do stuff that they, they've done I like that's not a hit, would not be on there, but yeah. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, but when there's, I can't remember the titles of the album, Sparks or something like that. Uh, low Spark of High Heel Boys or something, I can't remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just a good list and start to finish. Yeah. That's for sure. Uh, so TK would like this one. I'm going to put this on the printer. Zzz. Okay. Um, this would be great for all your nightstands, bedside tables, crystal sister, stay hungry. This is $12. It's a shame Jack's not here because one day he'll be like, man, I wanted that. So there you go. $12 for um, Come on, feel the noise. Yeah. Yeah, well, that's a staged or what? That is some serious hair. Oh, it is. Uh, oh, my gosh. When when I first saw maybe the video of this, and I saw him, and I saw the the exaggerated makeup, I want to rock. <laughs> Absolutely, I did not what to th know what to think. Yeah, so there you go. All right, Don, take it away. Uh, I've got one last pile. Okay. Here it is, right here, handily, right here. Um, again, $3 plus shipping. This is a sealed Elton John. Well, it's mostly sealed. Um, looks like the case got impacted, but it is a, it's a Columbia Record Club edition of Elton John, The Big Picture. It's mostly sealed. I have an extended version of Sticks Hits, 
So this one has, um, it's the Encore Collection. This has Blue Collar Man, Lady, Fooling Yourself, Renegade, Show Me the Way, uh, Lorelei, Babe, Too Much Time on My Hands, Come Sail Away, and The Best of Times. So those are the extended mixes. I've got, it's Pearl Jam, I believe. Yes, yeah. Pearl Jam. This is, uh, what's the name of this album again? No Code. Thank you. I can never remember the name of Pearl Jam albums. I have Gloria Estefan, Greatest Hits. Some more Frank, Frank Sinatra. The Cap, what is this? The Capital Collector Series, Frank Sinatra. Here's some Ray Conniff. Not just on mm -hmm. vinyl, kids. Ray Conniff shows up on CD as well. Wow. This is my favorite re telling of the Glenn Miller Orchestra's uh, hits. Oh, yeah. I love this. I have multiple copies of this. So, <clears throat> And is the rule now in the house? I cannot have multiple copies of things, so this one's going. But this is really nice. They do a really good job of reproducing Glenn Miller. Um, and then last but not least, this is not music. This is the radio show from War of the Worlds. <gasps> Orson Welles, the original radio show. So... That's three dollars. That is so cool. I know. I love the artwork from the movie too. So wow. Um I still hear the lasers. Are you familiar with uh Wayne his his tell of War of the Worlds? Uh it was more eighties and it was more rock and it was more like art rock. Oh no. Um not at all. You ha is it on like recorded somewhere? Oh yeah, um, it's a lame rule. I agree. I agree, Tom. It's a lame rule. But you have two copies of everything. Um, yeah. It's a lame um, rule. I agree. One for the car, one for the house, maybe. There was a song that was played on the radio, and it was by Justin Haywood, the singer. And uh, oh, okay, yeah. I'll have to find it. Oh, um, Arthur would. Are you saying you like to purchase that? Oh, okay. Let me put that down for Arthur. And let me put in again my email. Well, our email. That's right. Thank you so much, uh, TC. I'll show that after Don finishes. I will hold that and pull it. War of the world, huh? Got it. And that's for Arthur, you said? Yeah, um, so is Florida Vinyl Picker. He would like to know how much is shipping. To Florida? Right? I'm assuming that's a correct uh, description of where you're at. No, it should, for me, no, it shouldn't be more than $3. Yeah. $3.50 baby tops. And I can send it first class, so it's not, it's not going to be that much. Yeah. And there's your email, um, Arthur, if you would just uh, send her an email. And I will so, put you down for that one. So it's Jeff Wayne's War of the World. Oh, okay, okay. It, it sounds like it's this close to being a Pink Floyd record. It is oh, so good. Cool. Well, anyway, um, cool. it's being reissued, and uh, I want to get a I want to get a copy of it myself. But I, it's really good. So maybe if I go to YouTube, I can check it out. Yeah, yeah. And do you think I, they have it? And then I can maybe pick up a copy if I like it? Sure. I have it on vinyl, and a lot of people pass it by because it looks so nothing. And uh, But uh, I had it for the longest time, and I was like, what is this? And I finally played it, and I was like, oh, my stars. And so I actually bought a, a CD so I could put it on my hard drive. Yeah, oh. so there you go. Uh, TC says, we did our own version of War of the Worlds in 2018, the 80th anniversary. Oh, wow, Ooh. that's cool. That would be fun. Yeah. I, I just, I, I love the the original. I love the book. I love the original movie. You know, um, the one with Tom Cruise is okay. <laughs> but I kind of like the original better. I remember that. seeing some movie on TV as a child of that. Yeah, so there you go. Hey, uh, the Tracy is still available. She sure is. Um, TC says it was huge when it came out in 78. Wow. 
I think I remember hearing the song on the radio before. It was is very much a moody blues sounding song. I definitely got to check it out now. Oh yeah, no, I've totally been oblivious to that. Yeah. I'll be listening to it tomorrow, TC. The link is on our website. Oh, plug, 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 plug. plug. Yeah. And what is your website, TK? Yeah, TC. drop the link. Yeah. Drop that link. Don't be shy. Drop the link. Drop, 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 drop. Yeah. The little groove is in the heart to me, but okay. Forever Autumn was from Justin Haywood. It's great. Oh. Yeah. But um, it's kind of sad at parts when you listen to the War of the Worlds. Really? That's all right. Good music should move you in different directions. Oh, well said. Yeah. Wow, folks. Thank you so much as we wait for tc to put his website uh, <laughs> what we in, wait for tc uh go to pnr networks on youtube oh okay it's on youtube also hmm. so this side start why is it dark over here there's no light do you lose the light well this is my good no, i'm just teasing <laughs> yeah okay is it is that your is that your video is that your YouTube channel or is this a different one? If it's a different one, I better photograph this so I can go there and check it out. Oh my gosh. I gotta go check it out. Yeah, absolutely. I'm definitely gonna go check it out. I gotta, put, I gotta put War of the Worlds on the printer. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Our, printer printer could, our printers get W's, but yeah. So I want to thank everyone for stopping by tonight. I really appreciate it. Thank you, yeah, Dawn, for, me too. for joining fun. tonight. Um I always enjoy my time with you, Adam. Always. And you. your audience is amazing. And it's yeah. always fun to talk music. Yeah. And um, send our best to Mary. She's She'll be here tomorrow morning or tomorrow at noon. We'll be up and motivated. And for your, here. so you do a, a Tuesday and a Thursday noon yep. live show on your channel. Yep. And, and we uh, talk about everything. Would you put a link to your channel? Uh, I on, could certainly try. So if someone would like to check it out, they can. I come totally egregiously unprepared, so just a moment. I'll get my mouse to work. There we go. Hold on. I will get a link post haste. I am not the greatest link dropper. Jennifer is the greatest link dropper. Oh my gosh, she is the bomb. I am not that girl. I try. Here we go. This is the link. To our channel and we are on <laughs> thanks Kathy yeah coming out of a shell baby <laughs> you know how I am very shy yeah. reserved yeah Tuesdays and Thursdays we do an afternoon uh, Eastern noon show uh, it's ch called chick chat we just talk about everything and we have people in the in the chat talking about everything so it's just kind of a midday break there you go so and then uh, to do, come on down. There you go. And this is the YouTube channel for our podcast. Cool. Oh, you so there you go. Yeah. And I want to thank everybody for coming and hanging out with us tonight. If you're watching the replay or there's anything you're interested in, just reach out. And um, and there we go. Popcorn and roses. Oh, <laughs> how romantic is that? That's very popcorn and roses. Yes, Kathy. Gotta love you. Yeah, sure. yeah. So anyway, um, everybody have a wonderful night. Namaste. And uh, peace out. Peace out. Have a great night.